We have some interesting uh, things to share with you here, and uh, we're going to start by, well, we just did start, but we're also going to um, um, go into um, something I think that, that is uh, proper and fitting at the, at the moment, which would be a moment of silence and acknowledgement for Rod Goodhart, Eric Perilou, Leo Earhart, and John Hanowich. So if we could have a moment of silence. Thank you. Next, we'd like to talk about a, uh, a subject uh, which we've uh, acknowledged for as long as we've been doing this, and that is lifetime achievement. We've done this a little differently this year, and I'll tell you what the, what the thinking was behind it. Um, we have eight people that are going into uh, are, are going to be recognized for life, uh, lifetime achievement this year. They are Frank Arsenal, Hugh Quigley, Bobby Redican, Bobby Thompson, uh, Gus Moeller, Les Parks, Billy Reamer, and Rodney Goodhart. And the reason for this thinking, I got on the phone with the executive committee and we talked about it and so on, and we kind of talked back and forth about this. The reason for this, and, and all of these, by the way, there's some abstracts where that young man is standing right there, and you can go up and read those abstracts if you want, um, is because we got to thinking if, if we did this once a year, this would take eight years to, to get these people all in who have been the pillars of drumming for a long time. And then when it came to recognizing newer people down the road further on, we would be that much further behind. So when the old NARD started up with all of those people, and those people pretty much started the whole NARD concept with, with passing a test and, and playing the, th the uh, 13 essential rudiments and getting a card and so on and so forth, um, when they did that, the whole, drumming, um, the whole drumming activity got a new spark of life. Well, we wanted to do this because we want this organization to be the kind of organization that represents and promotes drumming for the future. And um, that being said, um, like I said, if we waited and did this one a year, it would like we'd be extending out like for eight years. So when we think about people like Jeff Queen and Rick Beckham and Dennis DeLucia, Tom Hannum, Charlie Poole, Jeff Prospery, so on and so forth, uh, the newer people. Uh, that have been, when I say newer, I mean like the last 20 to 30 years, then if we get, if we get these people on here that belong in here from the past, we're not going to be so, it's not going to be so difficult to catch up to the, to, the, to the present and into the future. So we just wanted to make sure that we didn't get way behind, so that's why we did this. If you want to read those abstracts, they're all right there, and these are all very fine people. And um, all people that we know in, in one fashion or another. So, again, uh, Frank Arsenal, Hugh Quigley, Bobby Redican, Bobby Thompson, uh, Sanford, Gus Moeller, Les Parks, Billy Reamer, and Rodney Goodhart. Thank you. <laughs> 